hailing all the way from Japan. Please welcome to Fresh Out Live, 1OK Rock! What's going on, man? Put it there, brother. Come by, man. Hey, dude. This is an exciting day. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm a big fan of you guys. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank, you. thank you. Thank you. This, no, this is really cool. There's a lot to dive in. We don't have too much time, but you guys just sound check for the big show tonight in Manhattan. Yes. Um, yes. This has got to be just so exciting to get back out on the road. Welcome back to the States. First thank, of you. All. thank you. Um, thank but you. But, you know, three years away, we we're all dealing with the pandemic and uh, we all had some time away. You guys are finally back out there now. Mm -hmm. How's it feel? Like, was it a big adjustment, kind of getting back into the groove of things? I mean, you know, this is, a, it's, it's really, really, it's been a long time, like, doing trolling in the US and also, I had a so much walk out, like how to work, like, yeah. you know, like that. And and I'm um, just yeah, and listening all the time, yeah. like yeah. You know, our new music. <laughs> yeah. Black this always. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Then we got here now. And you probably appreciate it so much now, right? Yeah. yeah. It was away for so long and now, you know, I know we do over here. Um, now you guys are touring, of course, off the new album, Luxury Disease. Uh, we just heard the single uh, off the album, Save Yourself. What was the inspiration behind this album for you guys? Um. You know, like the before the album is called title a title called uh, Eye of the Storm. It was like on a more like pop way. Okay. But uh, we want to like try more like a rock way for this time. So that's why we just make it. We want to make it something like fastest song on this yeah. album. Then save yourself, where they have such a good energy, and um, you know, like the most like the first song. So that's why this song is just the first song on this album. Yeah, and I'm sure you guys can attest to this. You know, the fun of making an album that's well and good, but then you play it live mm -hmm. and you get to see what people react to. Do you have a favorite song to perform live on this tour? Um, why is it your favorite? You guys have it. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I love Vandalize. Vandalize. So because uh, this song has so much energy, so much power. So uh, when I play this song, uh, I feel like so excited. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like probably more energy now. Yeah. Than giving it right back. Yeah. To you, right? That's awesome. Um, you know, you guys have toured all over the world, and you have such an interesting perspective as artists because you you see how different audiences around the globe react to your music. How how do they differ when you guys travel internationally? Like, what, what what are the U.S. fans like? U.S. fans is a, every place is have really good energy and also yeah. like singing louder. In Japan, you know, like Japanese fans got sometimes really um, like calm. Like sometimes, like when I doing yeah. ballad songs, yeah. they're yeah. so quiet. Yeah. But here, everybody gets singing, singing. So I love that actually. But you know, we're Japanese, so we love both. Like. Mm. Yeah, the New York City crowd tonight should be pretty rowdy. For yeah, you, but it's right? totally different. Um, now you've toured, you know, we mentioned you've been all over the world, but you've also been on the road with some huge name people, friends of ours here at MTV, like Ed Sheeran, yeah. Avril mm -hmm. Lavigne. Do you have anybody on your like short list of people you'd love to dream collaborate with in the future, whether it be a tour or maybe like a song? I don't decide it yet, actually. No. But like you know, we were all the time like when I some like special collaboration with the songs. Um, we first do things like more, you know, uh, make a friendly shit first. Yeah. Then we're gonna make a song if we're gonna send them on a page. That's more kind of sounds like organic things. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. So um, still we don't have a decided yet, but. You know, we want to twirling a lot of artists in US, you know, or like maybe Europe, US. Yeah. So yeah. maybe, I don't know, Young Blood. Yeah. Or uh, he's maybe... been on this stage. Oh, yeah? Yep, absolutely. Yeah. We, we met in Summer Sonic, actually. Oh, wow. He's such a cool artist. So, um, it's kind of similar generation too, so we want to like twirling with. Definitely, only if you guys dig that energy. I mean, yeah, yeah. Dom can bring yeah. that energy, right. dude, like no doubt. Um, you know, it's kind of funny, you guys have been doing this now for almost two decades and you've always stayed true to your sound and, and rock and it's, it's uh, you probably get a kick out of it now where rock has become so popular again. Mm. You know, what has it meant to you guys to see so many people around the world, not just here in the States, sort of rediscover rock and, and kind of fall back in love with the genre? Um, you know, we're Japanese, then like we want to make it more better waves in the US. That's what I wanted to do. Um, that's why we made this album. But um, you know, we our dream is like just breaking through in the US with the Japanese rock band. So um I'm pretty excited about things too. Um yeah. just keep doing the things, um, twirling again and make an album. Just that's it. And keeping it going. Yeah. For sure. Um, now, you know, there's nothing like the energy of like a great show and you guys always bring it. You have such a great reputation in the world of music to cross the globe of just really bringing that energy like we talked about. What If, if there is somebody tonight maybe watching MTV that's going to go to the Hammerstein show here in New York, what's like one thing if you could pick that you would want that fan to leave the show feeling the most? Oh, uh, yeah. 
um, I want people to think like a Japanese band is so cool. Yeah. yeah. And uh, like uh, after the show, and uh, people like leaving our show, like thinking like uh, mm, I can't wait to see them again. Yeah. 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 Just keep them coming back. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Smart businessman right yeah. here. <laughs> um, well, guys, thank you so much. We're unfortunately out of time. You do have a concert to get to down the street. So thank you very much thank for coming on Fresh Out Live. It's thank been an honor. You. And uh, be sure if you're watching MTV right now, check them out on the road. And also Luxury Disease, the album is out right now. You got to stream that bad boy. And thank you again for joining us here on a Friday for Fresh Out Live, the place for the hottest music news. I'm your host, Kevin Kenny, Air 1 OK Rock. Thank have you. Have an awesome weekend. We'll see you soon.